thing. Heavy duty brakes. So look at this. This is uh, this is what we need. This is what we're talking about. Holy shit! Look at that. Stop, stop pimping. What's that? Stop, stop pimping. <laughs> nice ride, man. Brakes, eh? Yeah, the brakes are. Uh, oh. Look at the brakes out there. See it? Oh. See, I was thinking of uh, when you said big Brembo brakes. I was thinking of uh, bigger than this. I hope it's the right one. I hope it's the right one. Yeah. It's a nice car though. Yeah, I just picked it up, uh, I to get it, um, December. December, yeah. Oh man, yeah. I like the front end, man. Yeah. It looks nice, man, the front end. Yeah, uh, it's only like 80, 83,000 for uh, kilometers. Oh, really? Yeah, it's an uh, old person couple that drove it, eh? 80,000? Yeah. It's not bad. Yeah. See, I went to read Jonathan to pick it up. Oh, you got it there? Yeah. Right, guys. So we got this Mercedes E300 here. See, it's in the garage. Concern on this is a brake squeal. So we're going to be uh, replacing the rotors and the brake pads. You can see the old one. You can see the line here. This is the original rotors squeal when you hit the brake. So it's time to change. So let's start taking out the wheels. All right, so here's the caliper here. This is the sensor for the brake pads. And then take out this caliper. This is the bolt we need to take out a top. And then there's one on the bottom. This is the sliding bolt. So first we're gonna take out the sensor. All right, this bolt right here, the sliding bolt, and up here you use a half half inch combination wrench. So just loosen that off. Same thing on the bottom one. There you go, yeah. yeah. Does Juice still have his uh, Integra? Yeah, nice. still does. Still have it. That's her high school green card. Green that's, card. Yeah, that's what he told me, man. Yeah, the GSR. GSR. Yeah, that's what he told me. All right, guys. So this thing right here, I did not put it on the camera. Um, just had to uh, pry it off. This little tabs goes into the hole right here. Just need to pry this off with a flat screwdriver. Sorry I did not put it on the camera, but that needs to come out and then this whole thing will flop over just like that. There's the inside brake pads. It looks like still good. It's a lot of meat. But you can tell that it's wavy. All right, let's put that copper on the side. We're gonna be working on the rotor here. So there's two big bolts right here, and this will take out these uh, brackets. All right, so there's two big bolts. You use 18 millimeter. We'll just take those out.
we need those stopping power, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Big brakes. <Yeah. laughs> Some people, they painted this in red. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I see that. I don't know what that is. I guess it depends on the person, I guess. All right, so this is the, the front part as this all seeds up to, together to the hub. You're gonna hit it with a hammer. She can take a beating. Yeah. There you go, man. Paperweight. All right guys, so here's the brand new rotor that we're gonna put in on this Mercedes. You can tell this thing is like some serious braking, big chunk of metal, uh, Pro Series brand, slotted for air cool. And on top of that, we're gonna be using this uh, Brimbo, um, Brimbo brake pads, premium. This is what we need. But anyways, uh, this is the, the parts that we're gonna put in and uh, let's get started all right so keep an eye on the pilot hole right there that, that really goes like that Alright guys, so the brackets is all torqued down to spec, it's stiff, so we're gonna put the pads now, put the pads, so the one with the bracket in the back, it goes to the caliper, but first we had to push these calipers back into the board, we're gonna do that. Alright guys, so this is the tool I used to compress this caliper back in, this, in the board. So just place it like that and then slowly spin it back inside. All right, so now let's put this uh, brake pads in here. This is on the outside. Okay, it comes with a bolt too. Comes with the hardware. This is like it's like aluminum. So fresh rollers and brakes to just drive normally when it breaks? Yeah. Okay. Alright guys, so Copper is all in there. Now we're gonna use this retainer to lock it in place. This is the trick part right here. Hopefully, it's not gonna fly out. So you're just gonna have to work with the one side, and I don't know how you're gonna work this with one side. There's much, there's no room. All right, guys. So uh, to do this retainer right here, you just had to bend this retainer up straight so that it will go into the hooks right here. I'll show you that on, on the other side. All right, guys. So this is on the driver's side. You can see we got a brand new rotors, brand new pads now. All the bolts on the back, four bolts are all torqued down. It's all nice and tight. Now we're gonna. Put this uh, retainer, this spring here. So just, you know, bend it a little bit and then we're gonna install it. Put the one side in and then this other side here will be a little bit out. Line up on a hole and then just kind of peel it out like that.
Look at that. Took me like 10 seconds on this side, and then on the other side, probably like 20 minutes. <laughs> it's always like that. When you do the first time on, the, on one side, it takes a long time. Right, but now we're gonna put the new sensor in. The old one is out. There's the old one. Now we're gonna put a new one in. Just compare what they look like. It's all the same. Just plug that in. Too much, too much already, and then yeah. I could just do it in a garage. Oh yeah, and I'll rather do it on the video. Yeah. So this side is done. All the sensor is all connected. Now, let's go on the other side. It will be the same thing as what I did on this. Side. Finally, this car is fixed. We got the brand new brakes in already. Went for a test drive. Slammed the brakes a couple times. It's good. Guy is happy. It's gonna... Off he goes. Yeah. Hold on. So off we go. Really nice cars. So, there you go. Thumbs up. Thumbs up means it goes bye bye so yeah guys if you want to subscribe the channel go ahead like the video and we get the jasmine here jasmine in the video again how are you jesse good good there's a bird oh yeah nice day today so yeah guys uh subscribe to my channel uh, we're gonna get more video and uh six excited to go get mcdonald's we're gonna go mcdonald's right now what uh what's your favorite food at mcdonald's and then chicken nuggets. And what else? A happy meal. And what else? Coca-Cola drink. I'm gonna have that. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. I'm so excited. Alright, let's go get McDonald's. Bye bye.